Kim? Just checking to see if your socks are back on since I knocked them off last night. Hello! What am I doing? You're the mother of my child. That is so tacky. And so is this way to hit that place. Ah! Right? Zoom, zoom, zoom. <laughs> So sorry. Relax. It's just sex. We should be able to talk about it. I'm not telling Isabella she's got a vagina till she turns 18. That's going to be an awkward birthday party. Do not tell my daughter she has a vagina. I'm serious. It may have already come up. A tip jar. Really? So what am I supposed to do? Just duke you my change because you poured hot water through beans? Well, I'll tell you what, my friend. Unless you're also planning on giving me a complimentary reach around with my beverage, I'm afraid the answer is yeah, no. Here's, here's a novel idea. Why don't you go fetch me a very large cup of coffee with so damn many fake sugars in it that the coffee itself gets cancer? So you're having chest pains, Mr. Turner. Actually, it's Dr. Turner. You look like someone I used to date. I had a brief older guy, Jones, but now I'm with someone more age appropriate, and I'm like, ew, what was I thinking? Mm, we are disgusting. Yeah, but for some reason I was curious. Anywho, I uh, will just run the usual tests. Sounds good. <laughs> Dr. Turner seems like a nice guy, and he's hot. You know, like if he left Brad Pitt out in the sun forever. Stop it, Elliot. It took you months to get over that old man fetish. Lonnie, he is private practice. Those guys are cocky jackasses who don't give two shakes about anybody else's opinion but their own. They're, they're me with one addendum. They're whores, and I'm not talking about the good kind of whores like my ex-wife. They're whores for money. Where the hell did you all come from? Sneak attack. You can put your shoes on again, guys. Nice work. Banana nut muffin, please. Sir, I've been told not to serve you. <sighs> hey, just take me. What are you gonna do, put me in jail? You Bob Kelso. Just grab me and run. Do it. <laughs>